Okay, <clears throat> how you guys doing today? My name is Hassan El Sadiq. I am the creator of the Hero Story Framework, and it is five parts of the Hero Story Framework. And I want to go over today who is this Hero Story Framework for? Who does this benefit? Who is it for, and how does it benefit you? This is what I want to go through, right? So the first thing I want to go through is the five parts of the hero story. Okay, so we'll put that up here. Hero story. Framework. So. Part one. origin story okay what is your origin story we break this down in the the, the the PowerPoint the document and we also break it down on the board as well uh, I have a video that breaks down the origin story part two this is your journey of findings okay part three discovering the hero okay and all of this is is it's is flushing out the hero story that is in you from origin to journey of findings discovering the hero part four it all It all falls down. Same thing as a presentation and it's, coach, co it's uh, coursework, but it's also coaching that I can coach you through this entire framework um, to get to the end point of where we are going in order to become a one person business and a personal brand yourself. But it's more than just business. It's more towards legacy and even further than that, cementing that hero story so that you live forever, right? Part five, becoming a hero. Again, it's a presentation and a video attached to this in the framework. And I go through and all of these five parts. This is for men and women that are over 40 years old. Over 40 years old, right? And in this, I want to give an example of why this is important, especially right now, not just on YouTube, but in the world, okay? And I'll give two video examples, okay? And I'll put these up in somewhere above me so you can so you can be able, and I'll also put the links in the description so you can see, okay? It's a guy, he is a, he is a, he is a doctor, a neurosurgeon, a neurosurgeon. He quit being a doctor. He quit being a neurosurgeon because he seen something more for himself. He spent nine years being a, you know, going to be a doctor, residency, and all of the, the classes and things like that in order to be able to do it. But then he spent another 11 years in the practice and he quit, he quit. And in this video, it's a 48 minute video that has over, 8 million views of him telling this story, right? The average person is not going to get this type of viewers just on a video alone. But the title and him being a neurosurgeon, a neurosurgeon that quits, that's interesting. I would love to hear that story, okay? So, 
us as mere mortals, we can't, um, we can't just say, hey, let's just put a video up, entrepreneur, and I just quit, right? That's not going to get 8 million views, <laughs> per se. We have to, more or less, do it more calculated and flush out our hero story so we know exactly what we you know what we can do and his is a 48 you no know, 48 minute video but that could be broken down and it could be done much better into a framework now there's another guy that's catching traction and in a couple of days he's at 22k views why it's better being broke and it's like from former millionaire okay okay <clears throat> so this this guy right here this guy right here was an entrepreneur in the clothing business and he took his clothing business and became a millionaire and he's from Canada he was an entrepreneur and in this video that's picking up speed he's telling that story okay what I'm trying to get across is Story, 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 story. Your story is your currency. That's what the hero story framework is based off, is based off your story. Now, these are just two examples, and I'll leave the descriptions to these videos. I mean, I'll leave the links to these videos in the description. So you can watch and you can see this is what success looks like when you tell your story start with your story okay now who is this hero story framework for let's get into it let's let's really get into it this hero story is for the person that is not satisfied by the status quo, okay? The person that was more, not a complete rebel, but just knew it was something more than going to college, getting a job, staying in that job for 35 years and retiring. This Hero story framework is for the person that did not believe in that. They had some success, whether in their own business or on in an executive level, okay? And reason for that is their experience is vital. They can add value, and that's what the key is, to add value. My question is, are you, with your experience and with you, what you know, are you adding value in the world with that experience? And that's why, like I said, this is for these people, because most of 40-year-olds are not. 40 above, they have so much value to add to the world through their experience, but they're not adding that value, okay?
also right here with that some success that they have garnered right they have obtained material material things car house vacations what have you but at some point they realize that it was something more like when I got my dream condo in Buckhead in Atlanta on the 21st floor I still was not fulfilled I still felt it was something more to life that didn't make me whole it didn't fulfill me no matter what car I got didn't fulfill me it was something more that I had to give this is not for the person that was in love with these material things and what made them after they got these material things they wanted more because the material things is what validated them it is not for that person it is a person that has that has achieved some success that has gotten the nice house the nice car they've went on vacations they've did things in life but they still believe they can add some type of value more it's more than this the world to them is more than things that's the that's part that's number one of who this is for if you're that person I want to work with you on this hero this hero story framework so that's the first type of person if you are this type of person I would love to work with you on the hero story framework the second person is a conscious person about their story they are aware but aware of what they are aware that they will not live forever okay they're aware that they they will not live forever and this happens when events happen in your life such as a parent passes away you start to be more aware that at some point the same will happen to you right and you start to think more about your your story plus more mortality okay So the second person that this is for is people that are aware. They're aware that they will not live forever. They're thinking about their story. They're aware of their mortality. And they're asking themselves this question. Am I adding value to the world from my ex my experiences sorry if it's spelled wrong that person that is asking their self that that's the second person that this hero story framework is for if you are person one, 
and person two, I want to work with you on the hero story framework, okay? The third person, the third person that is a man or a woman that's over 40 that I would love to work with and that the hero story targets is the doer. The person that is not tranquilized by just learning so much and they just want to continue to learn and learn and learn. This is for the doer, the entrepreneur spirit or the entrepreneur that has already been, right? That needs to round up everything in this framework from when they started up until this point and then how they continue to go on building that hero story. The doer that's going to take this framework and not only by doing this, because it, you, you have to learn, but you have to apply, right? Critical thinker that will apply this and and monetize the framework how do you monetize the framework and how do you monetize your experience how do you monetize your story it's many ways we'll start off by your YouTube channel okay what does that break into from your audience books, courses, products, coaching, okay? You monetize from your hero story through YouTube, from your audience to writing possibly books, courses is one I did not, that I missed as well. Speaking, courses, coaching, products, okay? Not just for this, because when it's value given that is an even exchange. So with this hero story framework, why are we doing the hero story framework is because we want to help the person similar to us that has a problem get there faster to their destination faster than we did because we have the experience and we have the knowledge and the know-how to get there, right? So we want to give them extreme value, okay? So the net, so that third person is a doer, a critical thinker that can take this information that we do in the class and apply that to a YouTube channel, to social media, and create products, books, speaking, courses, coaching, whatever, because they are given value in exchange, they will get money for the value and ex the experience that they are giving from flushing out this story, okay? So that is the third person that 
I would love to work with. Someone that's going to take this and become a doer, critical think on how, now that I have this flushed out, this complete hero story framework, because honestly, I am only at becoming the hero, right? I am, I'm, I'm at part five. I'm becoming the hero, okay? It could go to part 10, where you are the hero. But I'm at part five, so therefore I can help people with their origin story, journey of finance, can, discovering the hero, it all falls down, and then becoming the hero. That's where, where I am right here, okay? But I want to work with the doer that can take this framework to give value to monetize, okay? If that's you, I want to work with you. We went through three, three types of people that this framework is for so far, okay? The person that has had success, they've had things and they say, man, it's still more, I can give more value to the world. The second person that knows, hey, I am not going to live forever and am I giving enough value because I know I can give more, okay? Second person. The third person is the doer. The doer that can take the framework, give value, and also make money. The last person, the last person that is the target for the hero story framework that I would love to work with is the person that has, sorry, has the belief that what they have to offer the world is bigger than them, okay? This is key. The person that says, I got to where I'm at, not just by happenstance. It was some things that happened for me to get here, just like me. It's many things that happened for me to be here in Cartagena, Colombia, building my startup all dreams where my mission is to support one million dreamers through a platform um, that we are building, right? It was many things that had to happen for me to get here. But one thing I've always known on this journey is that it has always been bigger than me. I am virtually a vessel for millions of people so if I complete my mission millions of people will benefit from something being bigger than me and that equates to one thing, it's one word, purpose, okay? So that last person has a purpose to add value in the world to a person, to people, and that thing that experience, that journey, that hero story 
is bigger than them. Okay? It's bigger than them. And that's the people that I want to work with. If you are one of those four, two of those four, three of those four, four of those four, I want to work with you to, to go through and, and help you with your hero story. Okay? Because it's that important. It's that important. You virtually almost live forever when you do this hero story framework. Now is a time that we can digitally and virtually actually live forever through a hero story framework, through our work, and through the value that we are adding in the world. If you're only about you, you should leave my channel and go be about you. If you are about value and adding value into the world, please continue to watch because this is about adding value into the world. But if it's bigger than you, you are the fourth person that I would love to work with on the hero story framework and coach you through it. The target would be people over 40 that have those things. Now I know it could be some people that are younger that could have some of those things and would want to work with me on the hero story framework. That's fine. You can inquire for sure. But I am building a startup so I am limited on time but I know how important this is because like I said, I documented my life and continue to document my life for about 18, almost 19 years now. And my findings is what I was building was this hero story framework. Now I'm gonna help people so they don't, they can't go back 20 years, 19 years, 18 years to flush out their hero story framework because I found that everything is about story. I can show you an art article right now, I'll put right here. This is an article from the Huffington Post, huge media outlet that I got on from my story, from inmate to entrepreneur, okay? That was all around story. I've got on so many publications. I have sold so many different products because of story. And that's where it all starts, is story. Once you have this framework, not only will you need that for your personal story, but you'll be able to apply that hero story framework to a, to a business, right? completely separate from your personal hero story, you'll be able to apply the same framework to a business hero story once you understand this framework. And that's the video for today. But those are the people that I want to work with. And I'm only going to work with a limited amount of people, maybe five. That's the maximum amount of people that I can possibly coach and work with through the hero story framework or whatever. So I'll leave it there and um, remember, bigger than you.